Jersey, the string of phone call threats targeted 15 Jewish facilities in several states. When these things happen, there, there's, a, there's a deep effect on the community, and they are taking things very, very seriously. No explosives were found in any spot. Even so, Evan Bernstein of the Anti-Defamation League says a threat against any organization is a deeply disturbing sign of the times. The best thing that anybody can do is support the institutions that are uh, being affected. As for the JCC and Tenafly, members did just that, allowing evening programs to go on as planned. And the facility will open Tuesday morning as scheduled for what everyone here hopes will be business as usual. And even though those threats weren't credible,